Okay guys, in this video I wanted to show you how to hook the 8FG Super with a uh, forced failsafe for NASA with GPS. Now my mode switch is SC, up being manual, uh, altitude hold, and GPS hold. Um, this is my camera switch, SD. Over here we have my orientation, intelligent orientation control. And this is my force fail safe, which is switch SF. Two position switch here. So first step is, um, now the, the connections in the receiver are from the NASA are right in order. So channel one is aileron, two is uh, elevator, three is throttle, four is rudder, five is U, six is X1, seven is X2. Um, eight is left open. Actually, I have a uh, video switch for switch D here. Um, and I have X, X2 hooked up to the... Um, this is this slider switch is for my gimbal. Gimbal tilt. So, Okay, so we're going to get into the menu here. And the servos are pretty much in order. I'm going to go through the link and show you exactly what you need to put for the mix. We're going to go down here to function. I'll show you exactly which switches I use. Okay, so channel 5 is the gear. That is the mode switch. And that is on SC. 6 is on the right slider. That is my X2 for the tilt gimbal. 7 is AUX5. That's SE for my orientation control. And eight, channel eight is SD for my camera switch. Okay, so that's uh, that's the way my channels are set up. Um, you can move the mode switches around, but this mix uh, might not work. So um, be careful if you're going to go to do that for force fail safe. Always want to plug it into the NASA and the computer to double check your work afterwards to make sure that it goes to fail safe. This works on fail safe for manual. I can go directly to failsafe, um, altitude hold directly to failsafe, or GPS hold directly to failsafe. So forced failsafe, come home and land. Um, with, the, with it on manual mode, we're going to back out of here. One more thing guys I forgot to mention, and we want to go into the endpoints. Uh, I wanted to show you that for all the channels. I have it at 100 for 1 through 4, and my gear is you have your travel and your limit and my gear is 79 on both and actually this auxiliary is set too high that should be at 100 here we're going to go over to model and we're going to go to program mix and we're going to go to one which is off now I flip this switch it turns it on okay so we're going to get into one and you're going to go down here and you're going to, it says linear, I think, and you're going to want to go to uh, point. So you're going to go on to set number five, just minus 65, four to zero, three to minus 50, two to plus uh, zero, and one to plus 48. You're going to want to go to page two, make sure that they're gear, both on gear, master, and slave. Your links are off and your trim is off. Um, the action the activation or action turns on as you flip the switch and that's pretty much all there is to it you back out of here um, let's go back real quick I'll show you that that curve again we'll get into the mix so the curve you can see how it looks if, if yours doesn't look like that it's not going to work on on all three modes the forced fail safe so um, pay attention to that that's real close and important so we'll go back here and we'll go back to link and after you set it up like this, definitely uh, go in, plug it into your NASA, check it out, and uh, let me know. Make sure it works all right, and it should be okay. Thanks for watching, and subscribe to the channel, guys.